There's a lot of eyebrows being raised that Dakota Johnson actually has left her agency days after the trailer has dropped for Madam Web. Mm, mm, mm. Unbelievable. Outrageous. And yet, are we really surprised? Are we really... Do we really think that this was a good idea to begin with? I mean, for one thing, this movie has the Morbius writers. Automatic red flag right there. And this movie, for some odd reason, was being sold to these two that they were actually going to be part of the Marvel franchise. The Marvel being the MCU franchise. They, of course they were excited. A lot of people want to chalk it up to them being naive. Them not knowing what exactly that they were doing. I'm here to guess to you, or not guess, excuse me. I'm here to tell you, I don't think that's what it was. If you truly think about it, whenever you think of the superhero genre, seven, eight times out of ten, what is it that you're thinking of? You're thinking of the MCU. You're thinking of Marvel. Of course you are. Disney Marvel. They have revolutionized and have marketed themselves as being the only brand to think about whenever you think of superhero genres. Most of the time, you don't think of DC, you don't think of Sony, you don't think of Warner Brothers, you don't think of any of that stuff. You think of the MCU. And I'm pretty sure that whoever it is that came to her with this idea of a Madam Web movie told her that they were going to be part of it. I mean, if you truly think about it, they vetted their frustrations online and tagged the Marvel Studios. That was all that had to tell me to be like, oh, wow, you really had no idea, did you? Marvel Studios have nothing to do with this project. And of course, Kevin Feige can come out of nowhere and say, oh, well, everything is connected. Ha ha ha, big deal. Don't worry, everything will come according to place. Mm, I beg to differ, my friend. I beg to differ. The only one that is truly connected in all of this with Sony and Marvel is Spider-Man himself. I mean, we had reports that Andrew Garfield was going to be part of this. They decided to change their minds again to Tom Holland, and now they decided to scrap that idea completely. What does that tell you? This is a disaster waiting to happen. And if you know it, and I know it, and most likely she knows it, it's going to be a terrible bomb.